What's going on, Furio Hana, and welcome back to Vlogmas! Hana, we are newlyweds! <laughs> it still feels so weird to me. I'm still getting used to this extra weight on my finger. <laughs> but, um, yeah. We just really, really appreciate all of you, Fudio Hana, for the love, support. Very, very joyous to read all the comments from you guys. Maybe the camera should be back on you oh. since I'm driving, but um, I just wanted to thank everyone again. Before we continue this vlog, of course. And guys, we are right now actually filming the intro and we have our little baby Lucy here. Lucy say hi. Say hi. And if it's your first <laughs> time Furio Ohana tuning in to our Vlogmas videos, this is Lucy, our baby. Mm -hmm. Well she's actually eight now so not really a baby anymore. Yes, she loves car rides. Anyways guys, like I said, we're on our way to film the intro. We kind of did some intro parts like some clips at home. Now we're officially filming the outside portion and yeah you guys probably already seen the intro because it's in the beginning every year we do do vlogmas but because we got married the beginning week of december we couldn't start vlogmas like we normally do which we usually film every day up to the 25th of december but this year we're gonna do it a little different we're probably gonna do like just a couple vlogs here and there hope you guys don't mind there will be days compiled within each other hope you don't mind that as well but we will see you this intro got really long we'll see you guys when we're filming. And our first stop of the day is here at Petco. We're gonna get Lucy her annual Christmas toy. It's gonna be a part of the intro. So every year, like Amanda mentioned earlier, we do a different Christmas intro for our Vlogmas segments. And this year I thought, why not make it about Lucy? She was pretty much, aside from Amanda, the star of the wedding. So let's see what she picks out today. You want a cookie? So we are at the most busiest Costco in the whole entire world. <laughs> no, seriously, it is. I believe online somewhere it was mentioned that the Ivalay Costco here in Hawaii is the busiest in our country. But I, to me, it feels like the busiest in the world, I think. Because it is so crazy. No matter what time of day you come here, there's not going to be parking. You got to wait. It's like a Black Friday every day. <laughs> what we're here for is meal prep and our groceries for the week. So. Even though wedding mode and all that is over, we still would like to maintain our health. And our figures. <laughs> yes, our figures, but most importantly, our health, since we are in the food industry, food business, I want to balance it. Okay, well, next up on our agenda, we'll show you guys how we meal prep our shopping list. So, see you guys inside. And also, we're planning on doing some Christmas decorating today. Hopefully, we have enough time. And we will be eating. I'm so hungry already. How are you feeling? Know. It's very dangerous. Tell me not, guys. How dangerous is it to go grocery shopping or Costco when you're hungry? Oh my goodness. I, I can already anticipate the bill. E. Alright, see you guys in there. We're showing you guys the busiest Costco in the nation here in Hawaii. <laughs> I feel like this shot doesn't do it justice how busy it is. Yeah. We'll get you the shot of the registers. <laughs> I need blueberries. So far we got chips, chips, 
mandarin oranges. We always get these French beans. We get two. 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 I'll, I'll, I'll get another one, but I just wanted to say the secret to maintaining your diet is to find a snack you like and snack in moderation. This, for me, is a must. We never tried this, but it looked good and a lot of people had it, so that's why we're getting it. Off to get lunch, early dinner. We're here at the mall. This is our first meal of the day, guys. We are starving, and as you can see, holiday season is in full effect. Lines everywhere. Cars back up. Can't really tell. Local music blasting. <laughs> Anyway, we're hungry and we're picking up items after later. Huh? I did some online shopping. He doesn't know about it. We'll let him know later. I, I thought we were just gonna go eat. I'm so hungry. Just lost my appetite. Guess where we are, guys. We were just so hungry, craving pasta. As you guys know, we've been on a diet for the past couple months and did not eat any pasta. Everywhere was really, really busy except here. So we decided to come to Olive Garden. I guess maybe this is an annual vlogmas thing where we go to Olive Garden every year. I'm not once sure. A year. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, once a year for vlogmas, we go to Olive Garden. It started last year. I guess this is our second annual Olive Garden. <laughs> Anyways, guys, we're gonna dig in. We're so hungry. Our pasta and our appetizers are coming soon. Hey, for that. And that. There's a lot of onions on this one. Are you guys onion people? Some croutons. Ew, onions. Mm. You got all the tomatoes. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> I love bread. My pasta dish came out. I think they made a mistake on a man. This one is gonna come out soon, but I got the baked ziti, but I added on grilled chicken. Does that not look good or what? Oh my goodness, Furio Hana. Just wanted to share with you what I got. Of course, gonna get more of that lovely, lovely breadsticks. Oh, we got calamari. We didn't show you guys. Calamari, gotta have that. I got the fettuccine alfredo with grilled chicken. I know, I know, it's not authentic, it's not special, but it's just something I've been craving for like months and months and months. I just, to satisfy the craving, I have to get it. Don't judge me, I'm excited for this. <laughs> got extra shavings of Parmesan on there. We're going in. Cheers. Huh. Huh. I feel like Olive Garden is one of those places like it's not super authentic but when the cravings there you just you just crave it you know and come on endless breadstick and salad yeah love it love it after we ate we completely KO'd but if you guys want to see what I got uh, from Bath and Body Works I got oh, a lot of lotion. Pajamas, though. You didn't tell them. Oh, and look, yes. So we ended up buying matching pajamas again. Me, Felix, and Lucy. He's back there. Last, I think it was like Black Friday, it was on sale. So we ended up getting matching um, pajamas Ooh. again. Breath we're stinks. about to, uh, <laughs> we're about to get the tree ready. And it will be part of our um, intro. Oh. You're so pushy. Why are you so rude, Mrs. Lucy? Mm -hmm. From Bath and Body Works, I've got a bunch of lotions. These were all on sale for $4.95, I believe. Super good deals. Oops, these are the scents that I got. I typically like to get this one, the Ex Ultimate Hydration Body Cream, because it's very hydrating, and I usually mix it with um, 
I usually mix it with my non-fragrance like heavy heavy cream I have very dry skin so I need to use these heavier moisturizers and honestly when it's on sale like this I love to get a bunch because you can just give it away for gifts and it's a very good deal so each and every one of these was four dollars and 95 cents look at that I got a bunch of different um, scents and stuff a lot of these are the like yearly ones like like this is like a Christmas special one and then these I believe this is a newer like, one that they have all year round and then I wanted to show you this if you guys know we are into squishmallows a little bit not too much I don't go too crazy but I saw this at Costco isn't it so cute it's like a ornament squishmallow pack let me know in the comments which one you think is the cutest one <laughs> they're all so cute there were different ones too but we chose this one i bought this because i kind of wanted to give it away as gifts but maybe i'll keep it i don't know i don't know <laughs> but we're gonna get the tree ready now Finally, now that the wedding is done and everything, we can focus on Christmas stuff. Hey, what you doing? What you doing? What you doing, Mrs. Lucy? I'm gonna beautify you with your bandana. Hi, hi. Okay, thank you. Thank you for the kisses. Also, there was already clear lights on the thing. Yes, I told you guys. Oh, oh man. That Should we return so this? Are you ready? Oh, you know when we're at Costco, we should have bought the wreath so that it's not on the tree. Oh, I don't think they had any. They probably did, we just didn't look for it. Oh. I got the perfect ornament for this tree. Perfect ornament for this tree. Like this. Ornament for this tree. Like this. You know you're married when you know the exact joke your husband. You didn't call it out, so. I did. I said I knew it. I know what you're gonna say. Okay, but you didn't say. Yeah, because you would have changed it anyway. You you should have said, oh, I know what you're gonna say. Put Lucy down. <laughs> but you didn't. So there's no proof. You heard that, Looney. Right? Oh, we gotta put this on for you. Oh, my back. Easy, easy. Oh. oh. <laughs> what? I told you to take it easy. <laughs> Girl, stop, stop. What are you doing? Doesn't I was wondering why the heck you're like moving it like that. <laughs> it doesn't go in all the way. Christmas tree. Christmas tree, you'll ever be unchanging. A symbol of goodwill and love, you'll ever be unchanging. Each shining light, each silver bell, no one in life spreads cheer so well. Oh, Christmas tree, oh. Alright, Furiahana, that's gonna wrap it up for today's Vlogmas episode. Episode 1, I believe, right? This is the very first one, so... We, Adam, we don't know how many, though. Yes, <laughs> we're not sure how much is gonna be uploaded this year. As you can see, Lucy and I are over it with the hats. We both have hat hair. But that's gonna do it for today. We hope you guys had an amazing time. We had a lot of fun today. We hope you guys had fun joining us on our Christmas errands, I guess. Yes, our very first start to the Christmas season of 2023. And again, thank you guys so much for all of the love, the support, all of the congratulatory wishes. It really means so much to us because we just got married, we're newlyweds. So yeah, it honestly doesn't feel like anything changed too much, but 
it just meant so much to us that you guys have been so so nice and so kind about our wedding and everything and if you guys want to know more about the wedding maybe we'll do like a q a one day that might be fun yes and of course stay tuned for the video on that that's going to be a while but we'll keep you guys updated yes i think the only difference i notice after being married is um anyways guys <laughs> we'll see you guys on the next one Bye, all right good night for your happy holidays i feel like um <laughs> she needs a squeaky one. You don't know how to wait? You don't know how to wait. Let's see. Come here. No, I don't think I got it. Wait, wait, wait. Call her the blue car. Let's see. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Lighting, lighting, lighting. Oh. Wait, wait. Wait, Lucy, wait. Help me back up. Push my head. Ow! Wait. Oh, 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 there. Wait, there. Wait, Lucy. Wait. Well, anyways, we. Well, anyways.